Hey, what's up guys? Mr. Free Coiner coming back to you again today. I hope you are all doing well and taking care of yourselves. Now, before I get started, I just want to say everything that you are experiencing right now is exactly what you were supposed to go through. We are very close and I'm not even going to say that I'm not a financial advisor. I think by this point, point you guys know that the thing is my whole purpose has has always been to just be the voice that helps you get through another day another week or whatever time period you needed it for that's what I'm here to do now as you can see on my screen here something I wanted to go over I found extremely interesting and it, even though it doesn't necessarily or directly tie to XRP, it is extremely important for our timeline. Now, I do want to give a shout out to Constance Renee, or I'm sorry, Regina Smith, <laughs> Renee. Um, she has, man, she's kind of come aboard, come on to uh, Twitter and really taken off. She, um, definitely has put some very good information out there and like I said definitely want to give her a shout out for this article right here like I said extremely interesting um, so let's go ahead and get in here so chief police he says those of you who've been asking about the reset United States Treasury notes are gold backed uh, I'm sorry United States Treasury notes that are gold backed are being printed this week in Reno the IRS and Federal Reserve was supposed to be completely shut down on October 31st, but have not quite done. Uh, but have not quite done that yet. The Federal Reserve has gone bankrupt. Now, of course, the Federal Reserve is not going to go out, go out uh, without kicking and screaming. But um, I think uh, I, I think really this is the reason why uh, things have not really taken off for XRP just yet. There's so much going on in the background, and I've always said this. There's a lot of stuff, a lot of things happening in the background, and it just has to complete before we can get where we need to go. It is absolutely imminent, I believe, guys. Uh, I have no idea exactly when, but I feel um, we're, we're not talking a year, and I've always said that. I'm, we're not talking year, two years, or anything like that. We're talking a matter of at most a few months, okay? Uh, I think very latest will be sometime early to mid uh, first quarter 2020. So we're not far off uh, from what I can kind of gather from what's going on, guys. Uh, so just keep your heads up. I know it's been tough. I know you. most of you who are still in the, in the space uh, especially holding on to XRP, you're not going anywhere because you guys are definitely outside that realm of influence uh, as far as the uh, the negativity that's put out there to make people sell. Uh, and, you know, I hope that my voice has been part of the reason why you've been able to kind of hang on uh, this long. And, and also you've just decided for yourselves that you're not going anywhere. That's where I am. You know, I put my uh, my crypto on my ledger. I have a little bit on some exchanges just in case something happens so I can cash out real quick. But other than that, I am not going anywhere. So I know a lot of you guys are the same way. But again, this is extremely interesting. And one thing that I find kind of funny is that you have all these people out here who are absolutely vehemently speaking against Trump and they don't understand that, you know, at least his faction. OK, I think this is a war of factions, not necessarily just Trump, but his faction is taking us in a better direction than we have been going. So here Trump is ending the Federal Reserve and going to the gold backed United States Treasury notes. That's where we want to be, guys. That's sound money. And all that's going to do is pro help propel crypto in general, but especially XRP. Uh, like I said, 
all the things that are going on in the background right now have have been holding up this process uh, but I do believe we're going to see some pretty awesome pretty amazing things a lot sooner than you can imagine so if you guys get a chance go over here check out uh, chief of police might, might want to follow him I think I'm following yeah uh, go ahead and follow him and just you know keep an eye on what he has to say I just found him today through um, Constance uh, yeah Constance here so um, so yeah I'm, I'm gonna definitely be keeping an eye on his his channel and also hers uh, so another thing this article XRP is less decentralized uh, than BTC ETH and other crypto assets due to Ripple's involvement says institutional giant grayscale huh yeah so obviously the FUD is out there it's I mean there is another um, there was another oh yeah another uh, article that said something about XRP is going to go to zero dollars and all this stuff you know the FUD is still out there guys uh, and if you're new to the crypto space and you're listening to me or you're thinking about getting in it as far as XRP is concerned do not take heed to this FUD uh, fear, uncertainty, doubt that is being perpetuated by uh, these different um, news, you know, daily hodl and, you know, all these different news uh, uh, publications or uh, these different sites. Just totally ignore them. XRP is already established. Okay. It's not a going to. It is. Okay. It is already there. It isn't. You know, it isn't a matter of what's going to happen. Uh, will XRP ad be adopted? No, it's already happened. It's already there. So at this point, the only thing we have to do is wait. That's it. Now, if you are still being taken in uh, by this FUD and you, you're still not sure, well, I don't know what to tell you. But I can say this. It's very likely you could miss the bus when this takes off because when it takes off it's going to be quick okay so one last thing you better get on top of your tesla cyber truck okay because they've already got the site you can start looking at different wraps for your cyber truck when you get it me personally let's see they have another site here <clears throat> let's go ahead and excuse me go on over here they even have the broken glass and everything all right so this is just pretty uh pretty funny honestly uh the truck isn't beautiful by any means but you know what i would get it just for the shock value i think i said that before but anyway um they have all types of different uh wraps you can do like i said uh, i was playing around with some of them yeah pretty interesting i think that actually looks like wood i don't like that at all but either way uh, I would definitely go with some type of wrap probably um, do like one section just to kind of I see side panels uh, yeah something like that just to add a little contrast and and then maybe hit it with another type of wrap uh, everywhere else but anyway uh, I just found this kind of funny guys if you uh, have been following the whole situation with the Tesla Cybertruck um, uh, like I said, it's it's pretty funny. Uh, people get just oh man, they get bound up in so many, uh, or rather so tightly just over something like this. I mean, look, if you don't like it, don't like it. You know, a lot of people do. It, it, it's totally fine. Um, but either way, guys, uh, that's all I really have for you today. I hope you are taking care of yourselves and you're enjoying your time off and time with your families. Um, make sure that you really enjoy that we're not promised tomorrow um, several things I was looking at just in the last couple of days and it's you know just really sad how uh, how wrapped up we get uh, in in things and we just forget about our loved ones you know so I think um, that's something we definitely need to have on our minds on a daily basis I know me I am trying to um, you know just stay in touch with my family a, a bit more um, making calls several times a week just to, you know, let them know I'm there. And uh, I still love them. <laughs> and haven't forgotten about them. But anyway, guys, again, thank you so much 
for uh, sticking with me. Um, my channel has not grown as much as fast as I was uh, really hoping for, but you know what? It's okay. Uh, I've I've uh, done more than what I would have I would have thought. So I'm I can uh, definitely go to bed every night, no, <clears throat> knowing that I've accomplished something, and that something is in the way of about 5,800. Uh, just over 5,800 subscribers. So, um, anyway, I really appreciate you guys. Make sure you make sure you also hit that subscribe button button if you haven't already done so, as well as the like button and the post notification button, so you know when I post it again. Until next time, this has been Mr. Free Coiner. Take care of yourselves, and God bless. And also, get yourself a Cybertruck. <laughs> Bye.